You see that over there? That's a benighted hellhole known as Wisconsin. It hasn't caught on fire for a couple of weeks, but still. When I see how that state is managed, I'm like, we don't need that kind of malarkey over here. In Minnesota. I had to look within. My phone would not stop ringing, people imploring me to enter the race. And so here today, I am declaring my candidacy to be the governor of Minnesota. I was shocked to find there are more than 10,000 lakes in Minnesota. Are we ashamed of these other lakes? I wish to drive a vehicle with a license plate that is emblazoned proudly Minnesota land of 11,842 links. Stop the madness! Kind of a bring people together kind of a candidate. I think you'll find I'm the only openly silly candidate in the race. So there's that. Uh, since my victory is assured and I am sure as hell not moving to the Twin Cities, uh, I'm going to propose that we move the capital to Duluth, brick by brick. Um, there are several available properties that I think could accommodate a state capital. Duluth represents the unity of opposites. We're a little bit country, a little bit rock and roll. Minnesota needs nice in the governor's mansion. We're going to move the capital to Duluth. Well then. It's the unity of opposites. Duluth is a city of dreams. Minnesota deserves nice. Minnesota deserves nice! Yeah. Y'all deserve what you get! You deserve what you get. Turn off the goddamn camera. <laughs> I don't care. You can govern yourselves for all I fucking care. <laughs> I don't care if you vote for me or not. You can't handle this governance plan. Y'all can't handle this governance plan. Leave me alone. I think I'm gonna be sick. <laughs>